Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Just gonna do a little video today, uh, just uh, playing the game, opening some scrolls. Uh, I've got a whole heap of summon scrolls and faction scrolls. Um, before I get to that, I'll just open these ones. The Supreme Chest. No, I didn't get anything good. Just want basically the ring and Radiance Tribute. If I can get that, that would be nice. No, not today. Um, uh, summon Tower. So I've got, yeah, 100 Faction Scrolls and 300 regular Summon Scrolls. So just going to go through that today. Getting close to getting the Pirate Guy up to Immortal. So hopefully we can do that today, possibly. Um... Basically, just need I need four more of him, but I'll get one from here. So basically, three of him. I still need three of uh, I think that's a general guy and uh, Einstein. I need about five of him. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Nothing good there. He's alright, working on him. Another A hero. <clears throat> alright, so I will claim him. Cool, basically once you've opened 360 scrolls, you get a free S plus hero. It's kind of handy. Still need three more of the pirate to get him to immortal. If I don't get him today, I'm probably going to quit the game. Um... Game's been kind of pissing me off lately, to be honest. Uh, the customer support. Seriously, this guy again? Uh, the, the customer support is being a bit special. Ooh, got Laura. Nice. That's good. They've basically been giving, like, uh, free rewards to... Oh, I've got Medusa. Free rewards to VIP players, but only select VIP players. Oh, we got Pirate. That's good. So we need two more of him. Quickly awaken him. Um, yeah, they've been giving away, like, free rewards to VIP players, but just... Not to me, but... Uh, other VIP players, which is kind of fun. They give them custom titles and shit like that, but... Yeah, it's kind of... When you ask them, they say, Oh, we don't give it to anyone. But you can clearly see other players in chat. They've got the rewards. But um, Houston, again, I've already got him immortal, so that's pretty boring. Um, okay, so still need two more pirates. So hopefully we can get them today. Um, nope. Um, should get a S hero now. Behemoth. Eh, he's alright, I guess. No one really uses him. Uh, still got 200 to go. Pretty happy about getting the Laura, though. Uh, she's the next hero I want to get to Immortal. Um, she's a ranger and tech. Works quite well with, um... Attack lineup or AoE teams. Einstein, cool. So I won't need another four more of him. Um, I think that's right. I can get him awakened. Yeah. Awaken that guy. And Helsing, yeah, okay. We've nearly got Van to Immortal. Oh, I just need two more of him. So, Transcend Plus for Einstein, and Medusa at Transcend Plus now, that's good. Slowly getting there, uh, slowly but surely. Just looking for the pirate, he will just work well with my um, superhero and raider lineup. Last video, I think I was talking about the Vital Stigmatists. Um, they give me a pretty big boost in X Wars. I was on X, I think I was stuck on X War 29 40, so the last level of that. 
Um, and this guy is pretty average. Um, <clears throat> XWAR 2940. Uh, I've got up to 3120 31, now. So I basically cleared 60 levels just by getting those uh, stigmatas. So pretty strong. They're really strong on Rex, I found. Like, it just gives him a huge heal every time he attacks because he's always hitting multiple targets. I put them on my Anna because she hits uh, multiple targets with her ult. Well, only four targets, but gives her a decent heal. Um, I've got Medusa again, nice. I uh, should get her soon. Um, also, I've been putting them on Cyber, the Cyber Ronin. Really good on him, actually, I found. Um, he's just really hard to kill every time he attacks. He hits two players, so pretty good chance he's going to hit a couple of the vital targets and give him a big boost in heal. And then also his ultimate ability gives him a big boost, um, a healing boost as well. So he ends up healing quite a lot. Um, come on, we get something good. Oh, Queen, she's good. Uh, Chloris. <clears throat> I found she's pretty hard to use. Obviously, if you've got her immortal, she's pretty she's pretty strong. But I noticed she takes a few rounds to actually warm up, like three or four rounds before she actually does some damage. Another one of the van. That's that's a pretty good, pretty good one. Um, yeah, definitely Queen's good. A lot, really good for like PVE boss battles. So like some of these battles here pretty strong just because she does a lot of I think percent based damage so anything with a lot of HP she does a lot of damage too um, we still got another hundred scrolls to open like the faction scrolls after this okay Ooh, okay we got him that's good general unlucky uh, how many more have we got? Another 30. That's good. Let's see. Like in that one. So I should get him to transcend plus plus. So we need two more of the general. Queen is pretty weak at the moment, but is what it is. Just takes a long time to get them all up to a mortal. A lot of scrolls. Okay. <clears throat> all right, last pull here. Um, Chuck. Okay, that's boring. Right. So didn't get our pirate. Again, that's a bit unfortunate. We'll just do the last seven one by one. Nothing there. All right, now the fun ones. Um, gonna do the god god pull. See what we can get here. Don't normally get anything good here, but we'll go through it. Um, yeah, we just keep getting the A heroes. It's pretty boring. So, if you don't already have like a full lineup of um, like S, S plus hero immortals, this summoning probably wouldn't recommend it. Um, if you're still working on getting like heaps of heroes up to a mortal, then I would probably go with like whatever heroes you need. So like your nature, tech, lineup, whatever you're, you're running, whatever you need more of. It's pretty, they're pretty good. Sometimes you can get your S plus heroes in there, but I'm pretty set on most of my S plus heroes and S heroes. So the next step is to get the God and Universe heroes, but doesn't look like we're going to get one with 100 pulls. Um, no. Another 18 to go. 
Yeah, so, um, that's kind of depressing. Like, you kind of don't really want to play the game anymore after... Oh, okay, you got one of those, so, um, 100 pulls, you get one S plus hero. That's alright, um... Still, is it worth spending all the money on doing that many faction pulls? Probably not. Like, that's going to be a few hundred dollars of, um, what is it, faction scrolls just to get one S+. Plus. Is it worth it? Probably not. Um... Yeah, anyway, um, we did get quite a few S heroes in, in these pools, so kind of happy with that. Just need two more pirates, and then I'll have him at Immortal, so that's pretty cool. There is this event here that I could probably get the last, last two of them in here, in there, so we'll see how we go anyway. Anyway, that's it for now any other questions leave them in the comments um like and subscribe um we've still got a lot of more a lot of these iron giants that's pretty pretty crazy i just keep pulling him um he's already immortal and we've already got another stack of them yeah the next one we'll probably get to immortal will be behemoth i think how many of them i've got I've pretty much got enough of him to get to Immortal Plus Plus. I think I just need two more, is it? No, one more. I only need one more behemoth to get him to Immortal. So once I've got one more, I'll just get him straight up to Immortal. Um, but I don't see too many people using him. He's probably alright, but not the best. He'll be good for like doing your um, Galaxy Wanted Battles for... You are a dark faction, um, but apart from that, yeah, I'll see you in the um, next one. But um, uh, some of you guys are wondering how you level up past uh, 340, you just have to add resources here 10 times, and then it gets all the way to the end there, and then level it up again. Gets quite expensive there, but anyway, I'll see you in the next one.